Calabunga Tapper dudes! I just caught a gnarly wave and totally wiped out! It was awesome! Have any of you ever been to the beach before? Tap thumbs up if you have and thumbs down if you haven't. I love the beach. It's the best place to catch sick waves like these. I see a lot of you have been to the beach. That's rad. I bet you found yourself wondering, hey, what's making all these waves anyway? Well, today we're gonna find out with some totally radical science. <laughs> waves are created by the wind, Tappernauts. That's right, the wind. The ocean is huge and the air above it is moving all around all the time. That air brushes up against the water and makes waves. Check it out. This is like the wind out at sea, blowing on the ocean. The wind makes waves. The wind pushes on the water and that water pushes on the water next to it and so on and so on and so on, like a set of dominoes. And as long as there's water to push on, the wave keeps going. Waves can travel for thousands of miles. So, the waves washing over you on the beach might have started on the other side of the planet. Man, that's cool. Next time I catch a sick wave, I'll try to guess where it came from. Maybe I'll catch a wave from the Galapagos Islands. Very cool, wave dude. All right, I'm gonna go see if I can catch another one. See you next time, Tapper Dudes. That was awesome. If you wanna learn even more, you can find hundreds more experiments, lessons, and activities by asking a parent to go to tappityapp.com. We can't wait to see you there.